Greetings and salutations, YouTube Wanderer. The Lost One Game here, and welcome back to Evil Bank Manager. So, last episode, we saw Ireland pretty much fight off both Scotland and England at the same time, which made me question whether I had created a monster or whether I got exactly what I wanted, which was Ireland taking over pretty much everything. Um, so, they did, uh, seemingly, we did win those wars. So, Ireland is pretty strong now, actually. We've got a couple more territories to take out, and then we will control all of the UK, or Ireland will control all of the UK. We'll make them think that. Um, but, of course, France is picking on the Brittany regions again, so I'm going to have to come in and step in and stop this. I do have investments there, so it's it's worth me to come in and try and see what I can do. Um, do I have any weapons at the moment? I don't think I do. I know I, I turned on the auto-generate thing, um, I think, last episode, so we'll see how that goes again. Uh, get rid of the furs, the topaz, and the sculptures, and the stone as well. I do have some weapons left, so I think I'll get rid of those. Uh, to the Britannia regions here. Eventually, I'm going to have Ireland come over here and take these regions, so then my property will be worth something, because I figured out last episode, my property is pretty much worthless um, if I sell it in a region that I don't have any prop, uh, I, that we don't control, or that I haven't opened up in yet. So, it cost me 40000 to do that. It cost me around 10000 for me to um, start the war um, from Ireland's government thing. So, I'd rather do that instead, rather than spending forty k. So, we're going to join... Actually, that's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant. How much would it be? 61,000. A lot more than I said. Okay, never mind. Wrong. <laughs> Wrong. All right, so let's see. I'm going to go ahead and throw in the 65 and the 128. All right, so that's going to put us at 20,591. we got four more turns left. So, I don't exactly have to invest just yet. What's happening here? That's between um, the Papal States and Castile. Okay. I'm not, I'm not sure if I really want to get involved in that one. I kind of can't right now. I got nothing to really offer them. <laughs> but last episode as well, we missed out on some auctions or an auction. Uh, that's not going to happen again. This time I definitely will make sure to press buy because I'm so tired of being in these, in these auctions and not being able to do anything and watching everybody else get the stuff for the cheap. I guess the only thing is really um, trying not to overpay, but at this point... I mean, I guess I'm kind of willing to pay whatever because I just want shares. I'm kind of behind uh, everybody else, I'd say, um, all things considered. Let's see. We're currently, um, where we stand right now? We're number three. Uh, number two, the Bank of Girard, they already have 10% of the IMF. So, you know, they might be a major player in the next auction. Hopefully not. But, I mean, you know, we'll see. Maybe we'll outbid them. Maybe they won't have as much saved up um, as we do. They probably will. <laughs> they probably will. All right, so we'll go ahead and get rid of these um, in this war with France and Brittany again. All right, so we'll get rid of 64, 127 again. I need to see um, as well some more investments that I can make in Ireland right now. Uh, I definitely need like another iron mine or something. We got farms. We got a beet farm. I don't know why I've never seen the beet farm before. I guess I guess we've never really gone far enough to see the beet farm. So that would produce sugar. That would be 12,000 gold. So we got another fur, um, another fur bearing farm. Uh, the sugar, I think, will be pretty good. I've never had, never sold sugar before in this game. I don't know exactly how much it's worth. Let's see. Can I see it based on, I'm not sure if I can see it if I don't have it produced, which is kind of unfortunate. Yeah, I guess, can I see it? Stocks in our warehouse. I can't, I don't think I can change that. Anyway, all right, so I guess I'll go ahead and get the, the beet farm. I'll see how well that works out for the first couple turns. Hopefully it doesn't set me back too far. 12,000. All right, Ireland, I've made another purchase towards uh, <laughs> towards our mu our mutual relationship here. Let's see, our relationship as well, speaking of that. Um, I think, I, yeah, I think I turned auto negotiation on. So we should still be fine there. I can, I can throw in some extra meetings if I'd like to, but I think we're still staying pretty steady. So turn 92, 6,889. We've got two more turns left in this war here. Um, so let's see, I'll go ahead and sell them my weapons, 127 and 65. I'll go back and see if um, we have another offer for an iron mine or something uh, in terms of our investments. We've got sculptures. We do have an iron mine. It's not really exactly what I was hoping for. Um, it's not going to produce that much. There's a tree felling, though, so that one helps. Definitely. So we're going to get the tree felling. Um, and I think I might do the iron mine as well. Just, okay, let me do, can I do both in the same turn? Is that a thing? No, I can't. Okay, so I had to pick the tree felling instead then. Okay. Um, I probably need to actually, have I even upgraded my investment office at all this entire time? <laughs> it's at level two. Okay, so we need, we could do it right now. We could do an upgrade to level three. 
Which, have I had her? Yeah, I do have two managers here. I was wondering if I even had the second manager for this. <laughs> yeah, we have Maximilian Doman and Lawrence Carter. So now we could get a third. So I'm trying to see... Um, one, two, three. What is this? Is this like a level that we can get? Nine? I'm not exactly sure what that's supposed to mean. Find a pro, find an expert. We usually do the expert one. So let's see. We want to find... Would he be good in any other department? Um... That'd be he'd be good for the for the guards which we can't get another guard right now so I don't know if I really want to keep him around eh, we'll find somebody else let's see four yeah 11 that'll do I like him can I not hire him all right there we go Lester Percy welcome to our team he's now our best investor I guess at this point I guess it's the, the long flowing hair that he's got that makes him a lot better than everybody else <laughs> all right so Let's see. I should have some stone to get rid of, don't I? Do I not have stone? What happened to all my stone? Do Are we fighting a war or something where my stone is? Because I don't know where my... Did I already sell it? My memory is this bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, I have no weapons. Okay, so I must have already sold all that stuff. So we'll get rid of the sugar. The sugar is worth 10 gold. So it's actually worth more than our furs, which is surprising to me. Didn't expect that to be... I mean, I guess... I was going to say that isn't really... And again, I mean, people, what do you use more, sugar or furs? I, I mean, whatever, it is what it is. It's it's okay. I mean, I'll take it. It's it's whatever. <laughs> Still not exactly sure how much that iron mine helped us, Um, to be completely honest. Uh, but let's see if we have another offer for something. I did get the tree felling. Um, I guess I got nothing. That was the same turn, wasn't it? Yeah, 93. So let's see what we got this turn. We've got House of Gold. Another iron, yes, this is what I've been looking for, an iron mine for 9,000, I will, what? Oh, I forgot about that freaking crap. Alright, so our department's overwhelmed right now, so let me go back to the, let's see, our industry department. If I, I can't get rid of those now, because we, can't get rid of that now, because they're at war. I don't want to get rid of the tree felling, don't want to get rid of the stone cutters, I don't want to get rid of the other stone, uh, we're going to have to find a way to upgrade soon, um, which... Do we meet the requirements yet? Headquarters level 4. Headquarters, I think our headquarters at 3? If I'm not mistaken? Where are we at? We are, yeah, we're at, we're at 3 right now. So we, we need one more region to improve. God dang it. Yeah, the rest of this I could just buy. So I need that one last region. So, I'll, wait a minute. Who is this? Oh, thank you, England. You're giving me exactly what I wanted without having to pay for it. So, so there would be a battle between London Pretty sure Ireland has this covered. I mean, the last war they did, they didn't need my help at all. Pretty much an overwhelming victory here, even without my help. So I'm not going to even bother with that one. Um, I'm going to go ahead and invest. Let's see. I'll, actually, oh, we're making 300 bows a turn now. That's great. Go ahead and sell my halberds as well. That was pretty That was pretty big. That was, what, 140-something uh, extra units now per turn? I'll take it. So now we only need to invest, like, Maybe 4,000 gold in here. 3,000 to do it, but we'll just go ahead and make it even at like four. Though I know I'm not going to get this exactly on the mark at four anyway, so... <laughs> 4,038, there we go. They give me an iron mine in return. Great. So if I ever get over there with Ireland, I will definitely freaking take advantage of that. First move I'm going to make will be to attack Normandy. <laughs> Which is actually right on, our, right on our border, so that one might actually work out pretty well for me. In the next couple turns, I guess. I forgot to sell stuff, didn't I? Yep. <laughs> We had to sell the stone, the topaz, the sculptures, the furs, the sugar. What happened to... Oh, the sugar's down at the bottom. It was at the top before. That's why it was kind of weird. So I'll get rid of that now. All right, so that gets us up to 127,000 gold. Of course, the weapons will get us up a little... Uh, yeah, a little bit further. So now, the Britannia regions took over that area of France. France? I was going to say, is France even... France is still pretty strong. I've been trying to help these guys rather than help France, but at some point I might have to uh, help the other side. Um all things considered so let's see I'm going to just be well Ireland doesn't need my help I'll help somewhere else <laughs> I was gonna help like I said just as a show of good faith again but they don't need me. this one is one where I could just show my might or my power but do I really care about what happens between these guys do I really care I don't I'm not gonna not gonna do that one I still like to keep my spotless rep well I don't know if it's exactly spotless um, I was going to say, I like to keep my reputation of not really losing battles uh, that I invest in. 
or let me make sure nothing's going on in I guess it would have told me if there was I was gonna say because Korea and Japan keep going at it like every other every few turns so I was trying to check on them uh, 17,000 you know they're competing banks in this apparently um maybe we will just go back and help one of these other guys instead there's this one 28,000 I could join in this one make a pretty decent difference without having to actually do too much why is their flag just white it's just a white flag that's it they surrender <laughs> and again, isn't, I was going to say, isn't France's flag white, or was white? Mm. 26,858. Alright, so we got four more turns to help out there, so I'll see what I can do. Um, we'll go ahead and end the turn. What is this? If the enemy suddenly attacks uh, the regions in which your property is located, it is uh, always best to have a small... Yeah, okay, I thought that was telling me something I didn't know before. According to the rumors, the minimum acceptable value of banks will soon change. All banks that are cheaper than 50,000 will have to quit the big game. Anybody below 50,000? I don't think so. We're catching up on number two, by the way, as well. Um, let's see. 50,000. I still remember when we bankrupted these guys. I wonder if I could do that again. Might have to try it, actually, now that I think about it. Let's see. I want to give a credit. Who wants money from me? Who wants money? Let me see if I can do. Bardi and Perugi? That's the number. Isn't that the number one bank? 63,000? They want, six, want 63,000 gold. I mean, they're balling, aren't they? No, they're, they're okay, they're, they're, they're number four. So if I did that, that would drop me to number, number like six or something until they paid me back. Um, but I could throw them out and then, I wonder if I would get their IMF shares or do the IMF shares go back on the auction if they go bankrupt? You know what, just just because this is an opportunity here, I'm gonna invest, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give them what they want, all right? We're gonna offer them the full 63,000 and I'm going to see if they pay me back. If they don't, hey, <laughs> they go bankrupt. Those IMF shares, like I said, I think will either go back on the market or will come to me, I hope. Um, we'll see, though. So I get rid of all that. Um, where was that war that I was just helping in earlier that I wanted to go back to with the... Frick, where was it? I'm looking for a white... There it is. It's that one. I was like, I'm looking for a white flag. That's all I need to look for. Engine 865... That is enough to do it, so we don't really need to help out too much more there, but, I mean, I guess we can. I think it said it was going to be six turns before we really saw a return on that uh, loan there, so I guess we'll have to wait. Still, let's see, 18,000, 28,000, still don't need to help there. This will get us enough to upgrade our headquarters, like I said, right on cue. I forgot to sell my stuff that turn. <laughs> Forgive me. Topaz, sculptures, sugar, 160. Uh, and furs. Now I got 618 bows. We can blot out the sun with our freaking arrows now at this point. <laughs> um, so let's see. Up to 84,000. Uh, let's see. Where do we stand on the rankings now? We dropped to number 5. That wasn't too bad. Oh, yeah, it wasn't too bad. We'll get back there soon enough, I think. Um, let's see. Where else can I help out? I said I wasn't going to help this one. But, you know, I got nothing else to do. I think I might as well help out. The Papal States are fighting for freaking everybody, aren't they? They're in like three different wars. How are they even sustaining this right now? I'm gonna help Castile here. We're gonna sell some weapons. We're gonna sell them those. Um, that's not gonna be enough though. How many more turns we got? Three? Mm, I have to invest like a quick 3,000 or something in there. Uh, turn 98, let's see. There's another war between Britannia and France. Uh, is this for Normandy again? The freaking like second or third battle of Normandy. <laughs> I think. I think Brittany took Normandy, and so France wants it back. Um, you know, at this point, I'm going to help uh, the Brittany regions again help uh, defend this place. Uh, so France, guess what? You're going to have to eat your hearts out again. Sell these weapons, because I am on the side of Brittany at least until they get too strong and try and rival Ireland, and then they must be destroyed. So actually, once they defend this, that'll probably be pretty much it for me helping them. I think the next war, like I said, I might help France. I might go back and forth between those two just because I don't know I don't exactly know what I want to do there. Um where was that war again? It was this one. Yeah I can't help too much now so nineteen thousand gonna have to pick my battles here. So how much more was there left between these? Okay so I can go ahead and invest the rest of this. So we'll invest four thousand because like I said we're probably gonna take this over in the next couple I won't say next couple, but at least in some point in the near future, we'll probably have this territory under our control. Since it's on our border, so I'll take the iron mine. So that'll be enough to fund that. So the next turn, we'll be able to send our weapons down here instead. I still got stuff to sell. 
Let's get some 46 stone. I might need to start keeping my stone now, like I said, because once that region is done, we'll have to upgrade our headquarters. All right, so we'll get rid of that. 93,865. All right. Let's see. That war ended. I did help them, right? No, it wasn't, it wasn't these guys. It was another group. I think they won. I'm pretty sure I funded enough. I don't need to worry about it anymore. All right, so let's see. I'm going to... Well, I have to wait a turn. All right, there we go. And now we will invest some more weapons in here. 309. I have to see what um, offers the Irish government has for me now as well. Um, we'll invest the rest of this, the 6,000 gold. All right. There we go. And they're giving me a house of gold in return. Okay. Back up here. So now we have finally taken over... Um, England's gone, or, yeah, England's gone, so they no longer exist anymore. Uh, so let's see. Is this another? I had four turns left for this. God dang it. I didn't have to do as much as I thought I did. All right. Well, anyway, I should be able to upgrade my headquarters now, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, let's see. Here we are. Upgrade. Yes, everything. We can quick upgrade for 1,200, so I will take that, and then I can upgrade my industry department. Um, which is down here, I believe. Yes, do we have everything? We just need 1,200 stone. But we can upgrade this anyway. Um, after the improvements, we can have a total of 16 buildings, which is great. Um, so I will go ahead and do that. Let's just do 1,200. All right. This puts us in a much better position now for the future. Go ahead and get rid of the sculptures, the sugar, the topaz, and the furs. All right. And then that's about it. That's all I can do this turn pretty sure <laughs> I've helped out everybody that I wanted to help I've helped these guys out they should be winning now Castile I've helped out the Britannia regions who are gonna win against France Ireland's already won against um, England now it's just taking out Scotland and then we control all of the UK so that'll be good um, I want to wonder if I really want to push this now or, or whether Ireland will do it for me oh we got an IMF share I don't have enough funds god freaking dang it did I have to have a hundred thousand how much is this share good lord 192. They got it for 94,000. How much? This was 2.6%. How in the world? How? I don't understand this. That this one went for more than the last one. Wasn't the last one like 7 or 9% or something? It was more than 2.6, I'm pretty sure. And it went for much more than <laughs> it or it went for much less than this. How does this one go for more? I guess it's a little bit more late stage of the game and people are getting desperate. I didn't have enough money for that one. I didn't really know exactly when that one's going to happen. Sometimes it seems like they happen within 10 turns, and other times it doesn't. Because I feel like last time I went from 80, it was like turn 80 to 90 something, but it wasn't exactly 90. Okay, maybe I'm wrong. Um, anyway, so I missed out on that one. I said I wasn't going to miss out on another one, but that one I missed out because I was already overextending myself a little bit too much. I regret that already. <laughs> I regret that already. I mean, it's only two. It's only two percent. So I mean, it's not that big of a deal. Um, I mean, but it eventually it's gonna add up, though. Speaking of things, though, how much longer do we have on our um our loan here? Cause I I know I gave them money. They got okay. We got one more turn left to see if they're gonna pay us back. Now that'll boost us back up. Cause I forgot we lent freaking sixty thousand gold. It's freaking a lot of money. <laughs> A lot of money if they don't have it. Oh boy, this will be fun. I can get rid of those guys quickly. All right, so we'll get rid of that. Let's see, what war do I want to partake in now? I already funded that war. Don't need to help there. What's going on up here? Warband versus Pomerania. All right, there is one bank helping out. The Solly Banking House with 35,000. Is that their total investment there? Just because I want to hurt them. I'm going to help out the Warband faction. Didn't even know Warband was a place, but all right, or Pomerania for that matter. But I'll go ahead and sell my weapons to Warband. All right. Ooh, ooh, we've got muskets and things now. Was that always a thing? I don't have gunpowder yet. Yeah, I don't have gunpowder, so I can't make those. I need to find a place to get, where would I get gunpowder from? I'm gonna have to look across the world and see where I can find gunpowder. There's different areas that have it. I just don't exactly remember which ones it was. I don't know what that is. I have no clue what that is. Um, I was gonna say I might have to invest in a region that has gunpowder just so I can start selling muskets and stuff. But I mean, I guess you know, some people still run around with swords, so we'll do what we gotta do uh, for right now. All right, next turn, and this should pay back our money unless these guys are gonna go bankrupt. 
Uh, regions are constantly evolving, even in regions where we are full monopolists. Sooner or later, there will be a new property for purchase. The main thing is not to miss the moment. I guess that's pretty good advice. Alright, so they were able to pay our money back, so that's good. Where do they now stand on the list? They... that was... Peru... was that? Barty and Perugia, that was them. So we now stand at number two again after that, so... I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this indeed. We should be very well positioned for the next, um... The next... the next, uh, auction. So I think we'll be... that'll be turn... Was it turn 110 or something like that is when the next one should be, or 115 maybe? Either way, we'll be ready for that one, alright? I promised I was going to be ready for this one, but I freaking spent too much money, didn't have enough saved up. But, I'm going to end it here, guys, and I will see you in the next one.